What's going on, everybody? It's our Pod King Carter here, the Superman of YouTube. I just have to say one thing before I get this video started, man. 2K Sports, you guys got me feeling like Usher right now. <laughs> I want it my way, man. That's the way I'm feeling right now. And the reason for that is I want to introduce to you guys a new game mode for NBA 2K14 Next Gen. It is called My GM. Now I'm going to jump into that a little bit later in the video, but first I want to talk to you guys about Next Gen 2K. There's been a lot of questions out there, a lot of speculation on if people can trade their my players, trade their VC, trade their actual my teams over to Next Gen 2K14. I will answer that with, it is impossible to do that. You cannot port anything over from current gen to next gen. You cannot port anything over from PS3 to PS4. I ain't even gonna say, oh man, I'm getting an Xbox 360 and a PS4. Can I do it like that? No, you can't do it like that. You can't do it anyway. The reason for that is NBA 2K14 for next gen is supposed to be completely a different game. It's not even supposed to be anywhere near what current gen is. Okay, I'll take that in stride. So let's talk about my GM. Now I know a lot of people are wondering like, my GM, what the hell is that? Okay, 2K Sports had a press conference for next gen. They were talking about new modes, new features, new graphics, new engines, new everything. But what my GM is actually is a replacement for association mode. Now the reason why I say I want it my way is because 2K in the recent years have been going my, 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 my. First, they had my careers and my players. Then they had the my team. You know, they used to, They I, I think they're going to go back to my crew soon. But, you know, <laughs> my GM is basically association mode. But it is actually not association mode. It's actually franchise mode. Now, the thing about my GM is. It's actually going to have RPG elements inside the game. Now, if you don't know what RPG is, it's role playing. It's basically going to be you portraying a character within the game. Now, they say that my GM is a cerebral experience, which means every decision that you make, every little thing that you say to the cameras, to your players, to the, the owner, everything will change the world around you. They even said that the GM have attributes and special abilities. Okay, what is going to be an attribute? Being able to talk longer in spans of other GMs? What is going to be a special ability? Being able to look at the coach and when you tell him to do something, he's going to do it and not even stray away from Like what? I don't understand. I'm praying that these attributes and special abilities actually help out the coach and enables him to help his team and actually enables like people to become fans of the team because the GM is so cool. I'm just hoping that's the way it goes. Now, guys already know that in my career mode, you were able to talk to the GM, right? And have conversations. Well, my GM will include conversations as well. Now, basically what's supposed to happen here you're the GM, right? When you get asked a question, you're supposed to be able to have the intelligence to, you know, pick through whatever person you're talking to at whatever moment. So when you're say I'm I'm the GM of the Lakers and I'm talking to Kobe Bryant, I'm supposed to know how Kobe feels before he even comes through my door. I'm supposed to know what type of emotion this guy has and supposed to know every answer to every problem before he even comes in because look you can get fired from your position. You are not the owner. You are the GM, which means if the players don't like you, if the lock things in the locker room ain't going good, the fan base ain't liking you, your organization just ain't got no harmony, you can get fired. So you better know what's going on with your team, with your players, with your fans at all times. So if you're going to play my GM, you're going to have to put a lot of time into it. You're going to have to see what's going on with your team at all times. Don't just think you're going to play these games and all of that. And you want to know the funny thing? I know it's franchise mode, but nobody has spoken about actually playing a game in this new franchise mode i want to know are you going to have to be the gm or can you be the coach 
Um, can you just be one player, player lock and all that? I want to know all the features. I just want to know because I know a lot of people like my Philadelphia 76ers association for 2K13. And I was going to bring that back for 2K14 next gen. But now that it's called my GM, I know it's going to be time consuming. So I'm hoping, you know, the day to day decisions that I make for my team when I start this association or my GM franchise mode, I'm hoping that I make the right things. But they also they they put a lot of emphasis on this they said that we have built a completely new experience for franchise players all your day-to-day -day experiences have no right or wrong answers so don't think when you answer somebody you got to be politically correct or you have to just agree with you know being loyal to your high top paid players don't think like that think you know gm wise what decision like say uh the coach comes to you and he wants to talk to you about oh well i'm really not getting along with this player he's really not blah 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 and you say to the gm oh, i want to make changes and as a gm you have to say well is he going to be able to be you know applicable to trade off like is he worth anything can he become better can you train like it's probably going to be a lot of different things that you do also um i think that there are going to be cut scenes in my gm i'm not totally sure but i know it's a lot of cut scenes in my career but that's for another video that's for the next video but this is ikc signing out my thoughts on my gm it should be a great mode um a lot of people said that i think it's not multi-team so you can't like play with other different teams or see what's like you could probably see what's going on in the nba fees but you can't see what's going on behind closed doors so you know not totally sure what that's all about but what i will say is i cannot wait until i get nba 2k14 next gen in my hands i will be starting up all different types of modes simultaneously my team my gm my career i'm gonna be doing it all at one time so my schedule is going to be very hectic, a lot of 2K going on. So I'm hoping you guys will like what's going on on my channel. But like I said, man, I'm signing out. This is Siri. Thank you for watching and be sure to like this video. For more videos from this particular mode, click more videos. If you want to see more content from IKC, click subscribe. Oh, and don't forget to follow IKC on Twitter and to like his Facebook page. This is Siri signing out. Peace.